Hey everybody, we're back again. I've got a number eight hook and vise here. We're going to be trying to tie this fly up. So let's go ahead and get us some thread laid down. I'm just using my Tanda 210 flat wax thread. Let's just get a little build up here. cut off our tie again and I have got some new age chenille chartreuse I want kind of a bulky bulky chenille on this so we're going to take and get our chenille tied in Trim this up some. Alrighty. Now we're just going to go ahead and start wrapping up our chenille. Guys, I've seen a couple of these tied. I don't know. doing this right or not but I thought I'd try it and see how it works out let's get in here now and cut off this chenille Alrighty, now I have got some chartreuse silicone. I'm going to get me two pieces of it. Cut it off. I'm just going to lay it down right there. Throw my thread up just a little bit first. Pull this back and tie it in. I'm going to even these up here a little bit. Then we will get ready to do our whip finishing. and cut her through. There we go guys. Like I say, I don't remember what that's called. But I'll look it up, put it in the description, or put it in the title. We just turn it around like this. Not terrible, I don't think. Could have been better. But uh, before I before I forget it, we're just going to take. Put just a little bit of Sally Hansen on that, especially right where the knot's tied. There we go, guys. A little fly. Like I say, I don't remember what it's called, but uh, I'll look it up and put it in the title. And uh, we will catch you guys next time.